Hey guys, it's your girl Secret D. And I'm at work. I'm not driving, but we're gonna chat. So I came across this video last night, and so um I wanted to chat about it because it was crazy. I feel like it was a skit. I hope it was a skit, but we'll get into it. So this lady goes to her baby daddy's house and his wife is there and she's basically coming to drop off like her five-year-old looks like and the wife is like who are you this that, and the third and she's like listen i'm tired of taking my kid to everybody else's house i gotta go to work and his daddy live here so he's staying here so the wife is like no you're not da -da 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 -da. i'm trying to be respectful and she's like, okay, that's nice, but his daddy live here, so he live here too. So I got to go to work. I'm leaving my kid. And the wife calls her husband, and she's like, babe, babe, this lady's here. Obviously, you don't hear what the husband says, but the conversation was very short. So I really feel like it was scripted, but I, like the topic at hand. So everybody's saying that the side chick wasn't wrong. They're just thinking that she shouldn't have done it in front of the child. Um, I can't say that I agree because my philosophy on child rearing is a little bit different. I've been called extreme. But again, when a woman decides to have a baby, I feel like outside of financial support, a man is not... Um, he doesn't have to do anything right and i say this because women are so quick to yell my body my choice as far as when they want to keep the baby they don't want to keep the baby and so i feel like if a man flat out tells you he doesn't want to have a baby or he's already married or he's in a relationship or whatever so you know he is not your man and you decide to have a child I feel like now expecting him or forcing him or trying to force him to be um, in this child's life is kind of messed up. Like, it's not his fault that you went and got caught up with him. And yes, I understand that kids need two parents and all these things. But at one point, at what point does a woman take responsibility for getting pregnant by a man who's married or in a relationship or whatever like at one point does that happen at what point do we say okay well maybe she shouldn't have got pregnant by that man and so granted it takes two but it's kind of like i don't know how to explain it i feel like i never really explain it correctly and people always want to get on me but i also feel like she needs to figure it out let's put it that way and again maybe it's because of the way i was raised maybe it's because of my personal mindset i'm not going to force anybody to do anything that they don't want to do because i feel like that puts your child in harm's way as well because that's how people get vindictive and da -da 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 -da. like god forbid you wake up you see all these terrible things on the news and like oh how could they hurt a baby how could they do that because they didn't want that child so i feel like when you decide that you want to have a baby and you bring a child into this world it's your job to protect them and when i say protect them i mean keeping them out of harm's way and for me that's emotional harm i'm not pushing a child on a man that doesn't want to have a baby because then my child has to deal with the repercussions of what comes with that so i'm not doing that either y'all can let me know if y'all agree or disagree but that's how i feel